Hi, I'm Kira, and I'm going to be reading Hotel Bruce by Ryan T. Higgins. Bruce was a bear who lived with four geese. Reluctantly, but he was their mom, which meant every winter he migrated south with them. He would have preferred to hibernate. Migration and motherhood is hard work for a bear. It made Bruce tired and grumpy. That's why when Bruce came home one spring to find that mice had moved in and turned his house into a busy woodland hotel, he was not happy. Bruce was in no mood for rodents. He turned them out of the house and headed to bed. That's when the trouble started. It was a long night. Can I have a glass of water? You're hogging the sheets. I want to snuggle. I need to pee. The next morning, Bruce woke to the sounds of birds chirping and squirrels chattering and possums having a pillow fight. It only got worse. It's a bath. These veggies and spices are good for your shells. We hope you enjoy your stay. Thank you for choosing the North Woods Hotel. Our bellhops will see to your luggage. Bruce growled. Bruce grumbled. Bruce asked to speak with the manager. The mice went into another room for a moment. I'm not tipping you. Two mice came back wearing ties. I'm the manager. I have a tie. No, I'm the manager. My tie has stripes. They took my ties. They were interrupted by a commotion in the kitchen. Run for your lives. The turtle soup has gone bad. It was a disaster, and the turtles had taken his best silverware. Bruce started to lose his cool. Roar. I'm sorry, I can't understand your accent. Maybe we should hire a translator. The geese stepped in to smooth things over. Oh, he's with you. And the mice understood. Sort of. Just when it couldn't get any worse, it did. This was the last straw. Well, really, it was the last elephant. Finally, Bruce lost his temper. This is not a hotel. This is my house. Everybody out right now. Out. Sheesh, I thought they'd never leave. Bruce's house was a quiet, peaceful place once again, and there were no more visitors. At least for a little while.